Hello, welcome to Awaken Beauty TV. Thank you for being with us. Kindly share, subscribe, like, and comment. Today we are taking you through how to register your products with Ghana Food and Drugs Authority. What products you have? You want to register? Relax. Watch us as we take you through. One, before you register your products with Food and Drugs Authority, make sure your product is registered with uh, registered general departments. Register your business, source of vitalship or any limited liability. Make sure you register with Register General of the um, departments. The certificate you have, you um, do a photocopy of it down. Then get a name for the product that you want to register. The name of the product, so like waking, this is the name. Make sure the name, no one is using it. The brand can be different from the one you registered with the Register General, or you can still use it. Now, make sure your product is well packaged, having all the necessary information on it. If you go and the um, information is not up to, they will ask you to go and work on it. So one, this, like example, we are taking to FDA. Make sure if you say it's 500, write 500 ml on it. If it's 10 ounces, write 10 ounces. But before you write, make sure you measure it well. During production, it's well measured. You should have production dates. You should have expiring dates. You should have a badge number. Badge number, let's say you produce twice a month. Each day should have its um, badge number. Let's say you produce every day, you should have your badge number for every quantity you produce at a time so make sure you have your badge number then what are the benefits of the product you should have it on it how to use your product um you should have it you should have your ingredients very necessary and then your details um, your details the company's details your contact number your email now your gps it's really needed now on your product, your GPS, your email, your social media handle, right? You should have it. So all the necessary information, you should have it on your products. Register with Register General, your products, all the detailed information should be on it. And then um, make sure the contents of the products is standard. If it's black soap shower gel, black soap shower gel. Do not go and put anything inside and label it as this. Good. Then the next thing is you need a letterhead. Let someone get you a very good, nice letterhead for your brand. Um, and then a company stamp. So you write a letter, address it to Food and Drugs Authority on the letterhead. Then you stamp it. Few um, lines, I want to certify my products. Then you tell them why you want to certify it, right? Then you stamp it. Then you add six pieces of your product. If it's um, less than one liter, then add six pieces. But let's say it's liquid soap and it's gallons, five liters gallon. That one you need like two pieces. But if it's less than one liter, you add six samples of it to your letter, to your business photocopy of business certificates, and then um, you envelope it. They have uh, forms online that you can buy. You can print it out and fill it. When you go to their site, Food and Drugs Authority, you check where the certification for their products. You check it and you see where you belong. Depends on what you are producing. You print it out and fill it, or you can go there. Let them assist you to fill it. You can buy the form as well there from their end. Assist you to fill it. Then you submit it. They will call you to come and inspect your production premises. Now, when they come, what they expect is make sure your, even if it is your home or it's your single room that you are producing, or you have a small or bigger production place, make sure it's well labeled. Where you keep your raw materials, where you produce, where you do your labeling, where you do your packaging, your packing and all that let each uh, place no matter how small it is let it be well labeled your aprons your protective stuff everything is well neatly arranged neatly clean do that and then um during the production process make sure everything is documented let's say today you are producing thousand ml of um, 
thousand gram of bread or whatever make sure you put everything down production process all of them note it down um, we have a book called the um, quality manual book it's like the process of your production the quantity at a time how you receive your raw materials and all that happens there is well documented they will inspect all that if anything is left when they come they will assist you let's stop doing illegal things and uh, let's make our businesses official let them register for us so that we'll be able to penetrate to the market thank you for watching um subscribe share like and comment awaken beauty tv